What is up everyone? It's Son of Beast here and welcome back to another NBA play in tournament of the second game of 2K Sports. Hope you're enjoying your first game here of the Atlanta Hawks and the Miami Heat as the Heat moves on to take in the seven seed to face against the second seed of the Boston Celtics. Now the next matchup as we're about to head you towards to the Western Conference side as we got the next matchup to show you how it's done. It's Los Angeles Lakers and they're playing at New Orleans of NOLA of the Pelicans. We haven't seen that Pelicans win the game at this moment. It was nothing but they had a clear pull to make that one count. And there wasn't any uh, changes to find out what was going to be like. So we did not see that Josh Richardson was able to make a trade in from from the other players that made a, a switch to from Dallas Mavericks to the Pelicans. So it seemed like it didn't really bother us to try to keep it over towards it from everybody else. So here, it looks like they're going to have to find out if Zion Williamson is not playing with us for this part of the play-in tournament. We don't know what could happen. But anyway, with that being said, it could be determined to find out what will be. So here are the courtesy of the starting lineups we have. D'Angelo Russell, Austin Reeves, LeBron James of the King, Jared Vanderbilt, and good news, Anthony Davis is back. Well, without regular season, he was injured, but now, thank goodness, he is back in the game to get ready for the next one. And on the other side for the Pelicans, we have CJ McCollum, Josh Richardson, Herbert Jones, Brandon Ingram, and Jonas Valanciunas. Now it's time to get into the arena, where Kevin Arlen is standing by here at Smoothie King Center. I'll be on halftime show to check out the first highlights. Let's get going team, enjoy the second game of the Western Conference Play-In Tournaments. Let's have a look at the Mobile One Drives. First up, the rep. Bring to shine a bay. Making a good try up there. Here's the play. With the player, the combo up and in after calling the foul. And you can't guard that? Oh, wow. That's neat. Second player goes to watch me work singing. 60 bait, bait, and look at this try. That goes with that one, two, and three. Put it in there, baby. <laughs> Number three. This one goes to Random Red Goat. Now watch what the work course that does that. Here's what the planks go through. He goes around, up and over. Oh, that is swinging. And I did not know off the game was crashed. He thought it was gonna slam it, but he went that way. That was that was weird. <laughs> and number four goes to it's Mario 2K. Oh, look at that. A little contact, a little bump out, and then put it in. So, which one is your favorite Mobile One Drive highlights? Your choice on 2K TV right here. It's a 2K TV wow moment. So you know, make your choices selection right on here. And hit it on social media. And yeah, you can definitely be featured in there. Make sure you have it in there with the best one that you have. And for now, let's get going for the play-in tournament. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA Play-In Tournament. New Orleans, the Big Easy, has the time for the Lakers. The terrific kingdom of LeBron James and Anthony Davis are ready to roll as they anticipate the action here at Smoothie King Center. Lakers, Pelicans, coming up next. Thanks for 
very much. Well, Commissioner Adam Silver has a history lesson for those who would tell players to shut up and dribble. He says, in 1963, Bill Russell was MVP, won a title, and stood on the steps of the Lincoln Memorial for Dr. King's I Have a Dream speech. There is a through line that exists directly from Russell to our modern players. Kevin? That's a great story, D.A., thanks. Get ready, folks. These two Key matchups, LeBron James and Herbert well, we Jones, C.J. McCollum and D'Angelo Russell. That's great teams in the league, Kevin. As far as keys... And then Anthony Davis and Jonas Valanciunas. Van Austin Reeves. When they get across the area and go up right now. Our starters for the Los Angeles Lakers. Jared Vanderbilt out there with LeBron James. And there's D'Angelo Russell. And there's Davis. And it's Reeves in at the two. And for the Pelicans... They've got Jones. Richardson is out there with C.J. McCollum. Then it's Ingram. And it's Valanciunas into the five roaming the paint. Tip off goes to the Lakers. Here's Vanderbilt. Here's Reeves. He climbs up. Austin Reeves. Down the ball this day. Angelo Russell. Points up on the board here for the Lakers. Russell against McCollum. Shot from 12. And shot off. Davis against McCollum. Reeves. And that one falls. Austin off. Reeves. Assisted by Anthony Davis. He's become more of a facilitator. Actually, he's much more aware of how to make plays for his teammates. One of my favorite eras in NBA history, Clark, the 80s Showtime Lakers. Man, I played against those guys. Thankfully, it was just twice a year as we were in the Eastern Conference. Those dudes were unbelievable. Magic from the point. Kareem. Jonas Valanciunas. Finding his stride and finishing the break. They didn't just win titles. Showtime had a flavor that was fun to watch if you weren't being run out of the building by it. Vanderbilt the pass to Reeves. Lakers in the ball around now. And it's Davis missing. Exactly the look they wanted, guys. The right guy, the right play. Wrong result. McCollum with the bounce pass. It's stolen by Davis. And it's the Lakers on the break. Here's Vanderbilt. And the Jerry Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt. Assist by Austin Reeves. That is the perfect fast break, guys. Getting a hoop before the defense can get set. Now, here's Richardson. He is a good contributor to his team, averaging about 10 and a half points a game. Out to Ingram. And the pass to Richardson. Shot clock at six. And he could not get there. Well, Los again. Angeles foul. Number three, Anthony Davis. This was personal. First team now. Puts a lot of pressure on the defense. And the line for Pelicans, number two. Josh Richardson. They gain two shots. Typically, a strength of their 79% on the season. team could use because he's got a well-balanced 3 and D game. He does a lot for his team, brings a lot of value to whoever he plays for. And Richardson drops the ball. He's as solid as he gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Russell against McCollum. Back to Russell. Over McCollum. Here's Vanderbilt. Makes it out to James. Second shot opportunity. And he makes the LeBron James. And now a three-point play chance. Well, you know, and you're on foul. LeBron James. Joe is not just a sports personal. We're seeing foul. 
Man is it easy to remain in awe of the greatness of the line for the Los Angeles Lakers, number six, LeBron James, shooting one. Yeah, it's really one of the remarkable runs in the history of sports in my mind, quite honestly, Kevin, on and off the floor. We know he spends a lot of time and money to keep his body in peak shape. He yet is still not showing any real signs of slowing down. We know Father Time is undefeated. I tell you what, LeBron is giving it a run for its money. And you know, this guy simply does not age. LeBron remains a dominant force in this league, despite being in the league since 2003. Now here's McCullough. He saw with 19 points his last out. Jones looking for an opening. Pass to Richardson. Ingram with it. This one for three. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. I'm shocked that he didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every time. Coming good. Anthony Davis. The start they were hoping for. Yeah, shots falling. Off to a very good start offensively as a result. Pelicans trailed by seven. Richardson outside. This now to Dallas. to make that one. I mean, you have to make the defense pay when they slough off of you like that. Passes it to Russell. Back to Vanderbilt. And stolen by Richardson. Jones finds McCollum. Ingram outside. And the Lakers decide to take their first time out here. Well, Greg, we're in the final stages of the regular season. For teams that are on the outside looking in, what are these final games like? You have to continue to play hard because GMs are watching these games, seeing who packs it in and who continues to grind. So your future is at stake. Seems to me that there is. Because one way or another, there could be a narrow way to get this thing right on the target line. So when you know how to play this one to keep this hard on the target skills, you've got a lot of big communication that you are going to have to help your teammates on opponent. So there is one thing i got to have to keep in mind, you all. If you all are playing basketball, you got to know the steps. Because this is really the tough and challenging obstacles that you will have to face right in between for the offense and defense. Keep it stacked and keep it right at your at your bottom on the court. You're the only one, that's what you should know, that basketball is a tough sport that you get through. Anyway, back to it now. Back to you, Gavin. And New Orleans born with a whole new group out here. Big group substitution here for the Lakers. And here is Los Angeles now. Now, here's Schroeder, 11 points last game. Two is remaining. Two is remaining in the first period, two minutes. Back to Beasley. I go shot. Good as a jump shot. Good ball, Beasley. Consistent by Dan Schroeder. Pass to Daniel. Here's Alvarado. He's guarded by Schroeder. There's the pass to Alvaro. Just find the shoot. The three-pointer, no good. And so it's Hachimura who brings up the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. Seven-point differential. Bamba against Nates. Her passes to Hachimura. And no good to start the night missing his first attempt there. Coming off that win against Minnesota. Boy, you look at the points they produced in that game. Low ball. Well, it's really 
hard to stop them when they're in a groove offensively, and they were in a comfort zone all game long in that one. 50 seconds left here in the first quarter. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Murphy against LeBron. Here's Alvarado. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. James outside. Bruce Hachimura. This is by Jay Bates and Jakes. And the score reflects it. And you know, establishing that physical dominance early gives you a big mental edge, too. No place count that. And the Pelicans miss again. That's a rare miss for him inside. He may have just rushed it a bit. Maybe lost concentration, too. Hachimura with it over Marshall. That's the end of the first quarter. Of Los Angeles Lakers. 19. And New Orleans Pelicans. 6. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. 13 points up at the end of the period. And it's been their rugged defense setting the tone. Right back after this break. And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. In a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Lakers. To me, it's been the ball movement. That's been the key. I mean, going from good to great. Not settling for a good shot, making that extra pass, keeping the defense off balance, and taking great shots. And the other thing I've been impressed with, guys, is their assertiveness at attacking the paint, trying to hunt. So for the Lakers right now, Brandon Ingram. This game is Ben Russell and Reeves in at the two spot. And you look at the way he can get off a shot. When he gets to his spots, there's just no stopping him. Very few players can create like he can. Here's Reeves. Here's Russell. And foul. Oh, and it's foul. Number three, CJ Rapala. It's first personal for the top four seats. James Relators, number one, D'Angelo Russell. And the Lions are two. They have gone one for two, I think, in their previous attempt at the line. to be effective as a player in today's game. So the free throw shooting percentage is going up. Not much of a surprise to me. And with an update from the sideline, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thanks very much. The Lakers are, of course, one of the league's storied franchises. And Magic Johnson was asked recently if they have the best all-time He says it's not even close. Outside of Bill, we have all the dominant closers. Kobe, Jerry, LeBron now, Orvi. Come on now, it's just too many Lakers. Kevin, back to you. <laughs> well, he, he's got a point, David. Let me thank you for your report. Here's Vanderbilt. That's his second no, shot. That's his that's second that's basket. That's 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 by How many awesome times weeks. have we seen a possession? Take that from them today. Ending with a basket coming off a pretty bad. When you look at the assist totals, hey, they've been clearly the better team. Now here's Ingram. Boy, was he something else against the Clippers. Richardson. John Richardson. Physical guard now. This guy's got good strength. And he powers through physical contact and capitalizes it. Russell kicks to Hachimura. 
over Jones. Los Angeles with the first shot clock. Hachimura, the pass to Russell. Back to Hachimura. Another shot. Reeves gets Austin it. Austin Reeves. Reeves has got six. Uh, and the instincts mm -hmm. there for Hachimura. Notice the oh, overcome. Hachimura. The defense and then makes the right pass. Richardson gets a wide open line. This one corners off the mark. Lakers lead by 17. Hachimura, the pass to Vanderbilt. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. And that outstanding drive and finish brought to you by Mobile One. And that finish sums up the whole game. They have a big lead due to execution on drive, just like out of bounds. The ball's out of bounds. And the Pelicans are going to go off center. It's like verse number 12. And then no, for Los Angeles, Mamba is checked and in for And number six, LeBron and James. And James for Vanderbilt. And substitution for the Pelicans, Pelicans Alvarado. He's guarded by Russell. Shot clock at five. And the call. Lakers foul, number 12. Oh, man, Bob. It's first personal. First team foul. Out of line for the Pelicans, number 15. Jose Alvarado. Two shots. Two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for the the for the New Orleans Pelicans. Number 22, Larry Dax Jr. Now Marshall, Anton Murphy. And good on the second, so it makes them both. And we've seen not only some new trophies in this, but great, some of the existing ones have been updated. You okay with that? Oh, I am. In particular, a nice touch to have the previous winners etched into the base of the Larry O'Brien Trophy. That's a oh, James. This goes to this goes to I guess you know, that one to sting a little. You put a little extra on that one. And now another look at that great drive and finish brought to you by Mobile One. And putting that pressure on the rim. That's what it's all about. Threatening with that attack. James against Murphy. Pulls it down. And so James will bring it up from Los Angeles. Two minutes to read. Second half of the Two minutes. Game with the Rockets. They're in the midst of this long six game road trip. That will be game four. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. Here's Hatchie Murrow. And it's wide right. It's off the rim. Not sure what the D was doing. Breakdown, you can ill afford to give a guy like him that good look. Nance with it. He's picked up by LeBron. Outside Murphy. Hey! Hey! Murphy! First bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. James looking it over. Lakers passing it around from 10 feet out. And oh, wow. that time. Starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. Daniel from outside. Rebound the Lakers. Hachi has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. LeBron against Murphy. Russell passes to James. Goes up and loses the ball. This is for 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 the ball. This is 
to Alvarado. Here's hands. It's deflected. Schroeder outside. Got it off in time. And it's Schroeder for three. That's the end of our first half. Los Angeles Lakers 48. Uh, New Orleans Pelicans 15. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers in very good shape with a 23 point lead at the end of the quarter. They have made it very tough to get a shot off against them. Their defense has been stifling. We come back right after this. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Greetings, folks. As right now, the first half has already been coming out to a rushing point. Let's see how well they do in the first half again. The team of Lakers are pulling a stride. They're looking for a way to make the upset and try to stop their run on the Pelicans. They know they're very good, but sometimes, however, sometimes it does turn around the other way for the Lakers to try to pick up their momentum. Not really turning out to be the best for the Pelicans, but they might have to keep this size and the pressure if they're going to keep it going again. Because a lot of win here for the Lakers, they just try to fight their way through. A little bit of heavy traffic here for the Pelicans, but they might need to step it up more. Well, that's it for the uh, first half of the game. Now let's go back to Kevin Arlen, along with the crew. I'll be back with the post-game show. Keep on moving, guys. See ya. A Pelican shooting up Patriot 25% for the field. Four shot selection all around. Josh Richardson out there with CJ McCollum. Then it's Ingram. Then it's Jones. And it's Valentinus into the five. And that's the group for Billy Green as we begin the second half. Here's LeBron. And he folks in LeBron James. Lost his five. Austin Reeves. Coming from inside the paint now. That was a second look at our mobile one drive. Amazing control on display. And it's plays like that, Kevin, that show you why they are so far ahead. It didn't settle for anything outside and went right to the rim. Alan Judas finds McCollum. And the Pelicans miss again. And the edge on the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. And really a reflection of their superior effort level to this point. It seems to me. They've gone after this win a little bit more. Six to shoot. Back to Russell. Reeves gets the Austin ball. Austin Reeves. Reeves has got ten points in the game. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Almost no holes in their performance tonight. They've been tremendous. Here's McCollum. Again, McCollum missing. Well, an awful beginning to this half, guys. Missing their first four attempts. Angelo Russell, the second overall pick in 2015. Yeah, pretty interesting too, Kevin, that the Lakers traded him after just his second season. It was basically a salary dump. It wasn't about talent because he's got plenty of that, but he was young when he came into the league. He had a reset at age 21 and then went on to rebuild his stock in Brooklyn, making an all-star game there. And by doing that, showed everybody that he could start over back to Vanderbilt. Goes up on the high post. Yes, that's a good down to the assist. Assist this is from LeBron Jason James. for the game. And first time out of the game. Time out, Paul. We're going to do another five games. Oftentimes, Clark with Jerry Vanderbilt, whose impact is in reflected in the box score. Yeah, you know, that's a good point, Kevin. He puts up a solid thing, but I don't know him, but I think it's his defense, which is his greatest attribute. He's locked down the defender, and he's a high energy hustle guy. He's playing with a lot of that has value on just about any team. The NBA 2K23 of the NBA playing tournaments is brought to you by Mountain Dew. Dew to do. State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. Talk to talk or call again. Quick to give a free quote today. 
and by Kia. Visit your local Kia dealer today. In a moment, that expires. Inspiring the truth can always be remembered of. The Lakers are pushing their way to make an inbounding to go right into against the, the second seed of the team against the Memphis Grizzlies. They could be going for it. We may not know what will happen. Kingsley's checked in. Into the third to go. Two minutes in now. And it's for missing. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. <laughs> and he gets well, it to the Beasley. Beasley. Beasley's got his second bucket. You know, a marksman like Beasley, not thrown by a little bump. He stays committed and gets his shot off. Pass to Richardson. I'll call him outside. Trying to get something going. CJ McCollum. Such a gift to his team. To the paint. Davis. Assist by LeBron James. Prolific and efficient. Boy, I like the disposition and attitude since halftime. They're patiently looking for good shots. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. McCollum with the bounce pass. Ingram takes the Jones. Flying with his three. That's a look you cannot pass up. It's also one you should miss. A pass to Davis. Pass to Reeves. Let's it go from deep. And that one is off. New Orleans got the blank from three point land so far in the third. Still 0 for 3. And the pass to CJ Bacala. Just not a score and defender, folks. He can pass it, too. Easily outside. Here's Reeves. He is guarded by McCollum. James, the pass to Beasley. Two minutes for me. He's ready in the third quarter. Two minutes. And the Lakers get it back. Eyes again. Basket is... LeBron James. One more at the line. Number two, only for the Belgrade and Pelicans. This was a personal foul. First team foul at the Lamb for Lakers, LeBron James. With one shot, due to the position for the Los Angeles Lakers. Number 22, he's got a shooter. And for new early Pelicans, for all substitution. Marshall, Ed Studio, Murphy, and Alvarado. can appreciate that kind of action. And also, guys, they push the ball and been able to score in transition, trying to take advantage of playing in the open floor as often as possible. This is a good Daniels. Here's Alvarado. He's guarded by Schroeder, the nine-foot shot, and Davis sends it back. Not only does Davis have great skill, but he is tremendously agile. He can get his shots from just about every Davis. Assist on LeBron James. And quickly takes it back. Boy, the defense looks shell shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now, on their heels. Pass to Daniel. Al Murphy. Nance outside. There's Alvarado. 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 Larry Nance Jr. More shots from beyond the arc. Trying to score in chunks. I don't know if that's the recipe. Your passes to Davis. Here's James. Yep, that one goes to James. James. Got 14. And he's the main. This is from Anthony Davis. They have the lead right now. He's been perfect from the field, literally. Here's the pass to Murphy. Hands with it. Marshall kicks to Nance. Orleans moving it around. Here's Daniels. Can change shot, and that's two points. Daniels. Aggressive play right there. Saw the smaller man on him, and he 
and took it straight to the net. As the Vanderbilt. Schroeder outside. Off target with this three. New Orleans has gone one of four and three point shots here in the third. If he passes to Marshall. Here's Alvarado. And get off the ball. Thank you. Alvarado. Just ask him to get burned if you do. And here is LeBron. He's got 14. Schroeder, left side. A shot. That is Schroeder. That's in our pro quarter. Los Angeles Lakers, 52. And then you're on Pelicans, 27. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers leading by a full 31 points at the end of the quarter. The scoring has been tremendous, and they are shooting lights out with fairly high accuracy. Back right after this. Look at today's State Farm assist of the game. And definitely deserving of the prize tonight. How about the read he made here? Looking like a point guard putting the pass right on the money. Terrific versatility coming from a big man. Not something that the majority of big guys possess. to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. And on the court for the Lakers to start the fourth. Jared Vanderbilt. Jared Vanderbilt out there with Anthony. Oh, this from and it's Reed. Then it's Schroeder. James in at the three spot. And you know, we all know Schroeder can score now, but there, a nice assist to his wide open teammate. To the inside. Galvarado passes to Marshall. Schroeder surveying the floor. Kicks to James. Missile blow. Rodgers. He'll have a chance to do it. No, I'm going to be foul number 22. Oh, I'm going to shoot you. Can match the Brown when he's first person up. Really good scoring. Sure, Steve Fowl. Searching himself on offense. Cheers to Los Angeles. Rodgers. The line will be on. In this era of player movement, Greg, we're seeing guys often pick teams on fit or style of play. When they look at that, what are they looking into? You want to have fun coming to work every day, Kevin. I mean, the, the money they're making, most guys are going to be set for life. But Mind I the think leg. they recognize the it's about the journey and who you have the opportunity to take that journey with. So it's McCollum. He'll bring it up for the Pelican. He's looking for Hayes and finds him. Jersey Hayes! Hey. Hey. CJ McCollum. The open teammate. And that last look brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam King. Passes to Reed. McCollum against Schroeder. He had stolen by Hayes. We play just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Marshall dishes to Daniels. Pass to McCollum. He's with it. He's picked up by LeBron. From 10 feet out. And there's McCollum. CJ McCollum. He didn't have a single point in the first half. Baby. Zero points. Not him. He's starting to get into the groove here in the second. And that one's good. Get a shooter. And this from LeBron James. Like a man and staying in control. Colin passes to Marshall. Now the pass to McCollum. And here's Hayes. Marshall decided where to go with it. Leaps for it. Out of bounds. The Lakers beat the Los Angeles ball. So for the Cubs. Three substitution for the Los Angeles Sabres. Number 35. And Los Angeles Gabriel. Gabriel change here as well. Gabriel 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 checked in. And we have to take another glance at that powerful rejection. And sharp instincts on D there. Just timing. When to rise up and swat that one away. I don't think he wasn't swatting. And we're around. All he was just doing was hitting the elbow. Has to read. 
Ball Greg, the league trending towards small ball, but some teams are having success playing two picks up front. Yeah, I think the key is having personal big that they can space the floor and play in space, also be able to cover smaller players. Why not get the added rebounding and rim protection? Here's Daniels, five on the clock. That shot off the mark. So the Lakers will take it the other way. And physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. A plus 10 rebound advantage tells you all you need to know. The kick out to Brown. Passes it to Gabriel. Gets rebounded by New Orleans. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Temple, the pass to McCollum. Defense is right there. Daniel. Daniel. On the one hand, he's not going to mess that one up. I certainly hope not. Has to read. Back to Schroeder. Gabriel. LaVaz to Bamba. And the shot goes oh, down. When you look at Bamba, he has extraordinary length. And because of that, he's able to finish over most defenders. A pass to Daniels. Somebody's passing here by New Orleans. Gary Herdan Gomez. Passes like that go a long way. Terrific teamwork. CJ McCullough. Out to the right wing. Brown outside. McCullough against Schroeder. Two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter to play. Two minutes. Back to Schroeder. Fires the three. No good. And New Orleans will go the other way with it. I'll call him outside. Now Daniels. To the middle. Tries from seven. Walker's checked in for Dennis Schroeder. Lakers have gone four of seven from the field since the beginning of the fourth. And right from the get-go, they stood out as the better team. Their hunger to dominate and play for each other was outstanding for the Lakers. This was a team performing to its uh, fullest capability. Uh, a, a hugely satisfying win. Uh, a game that not many will soon forget. And on the other side, one that uh, I think most will try to forget. And for the year now, they'll ramp up their win total to an even 40. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And, and look at the stats. Just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for LeBron. Boy, this game really had his name all over it. I mean, Grellis being the guy who carried the load offense. The second effort. Brennan Gomez, no good. I'm a fan of anybody who defends that way. I mean, they weren't about to open the door and just allow him to walk those in. And they came in determined to take this one. It's going to be a happy flight home. Yep, to have a stress-free win on the road, very satisfying. The fans are already headed for the exit. And that's a good stop. The second person. Uh, uh, all the way over uh, here to uh, uh, where we are. Foul. At the line for elegance. Yeah, it's a tipple. At the line for two. First free throw is good. Do substitution for the Pelicans. Number eight. Dolan Marshall. And 
and both free throws are good for Temple. There's 10 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Now here's Walker. The final score for tonight's game, Los Angeles Sabres 68, and Rural Pelicans 36. What an efficient performance at both ends. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Anthony. Great team win. How important are those contributions? That was one through fifteen tonight, man. Thanks. Back to you guys. All right, David. Great job. Thanks so much. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Clark Kellogg, Craig Anthony, and David Alder, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. We'll see you next time. All right, Kevin, thank you very much. As for this point, this is a crush out for the Lakers to start their own win here for the first one to battle against the second seed of the team to face against the Grizzlies of Memphis. Now, they're not really important to try to, like, keep them out of tight of the square spacing in between by the player of LeBron James and C.J. McCollum. Not really too much to give this thing an off-topic run. But it may not be tough enough to try to, like, fix it from itself. From the deco, from the section of it, 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 it can be very difficult to try to keep them over. But now, but now... It's about to let this thing go happen to fly by in between. So at that point, it's about to find out who's going to advance to the next spot in the location. Well, we're not even sure what's it going to be, but uh, we'll have to find out what will happen. Here's how they did with the summary statistic look. 31 percentage out of 44. 70 percent for the Lakers. 8, 42, 6, 23, and 28. That turned out to be fast break, points and paint, second chance points, and bench points. Assist was 28. Only 8 offensive rebounds for the Pelicans. And 22 for defensive rebounds for the Lakers. 3 steals and 5 blocks. Oh my goodness, they're doing really well. Better than, uh, than any of the other guys who were doing a little bit of blocking. But, um, you know, it's not going to be really happening. Two turnovers, points off with six for Lakers. Team fouls was only less. Six dunks. Wow. I don't know what to say about that. There was a lot of them. 36 biggest lead of a change and time of possession was 12-31 for the Pelicans. Very quiet, very well pre-phased out. Now for the three-star players of the game, this all goes to all Lakers. So let's have a look and see what we've got. The third star, we go just down to the bottom right here for the third star. We got a good look of it in, in between the good and the bad, but not everybody's favorite choice. That's all I've got. We have is Jared Vanderbilt. Only had received eight points and eight rebounds, and only two assists was being informed for two dunks and only 12 performance run on the bill. Yeah, it does happen to him. Welcome to the Lakers. Thanks for playing with the Timberwolves. Couldn't have greater without you. Number two. The other hand that did turn out to be more powerful, we have is Austin Reeves that played here for the first time with the Lakers. Ten points and three assists. He is a clean look. I mean, great job for Austin Reeves. Maybe his next poem can be lifting up to its new height of next season. And to number one star, well... All rise up. The king has finally been chosen. It's LeBron James. 17.6 rebounds, 10 assists. Excellent job. And one dunk has performed and a steal had made. So that is it for the first game of the Western Conference of the play-in tournaments. Now for the next spot of it, we are going to 9th versus 10th seed right in between the two. First, 
in the Eastern Conference section, we've got a good look of a team that turned out to be one of the bestest. We've got the Raptors and the Bulls, since we have seen them last season of the regular season in Toronto. Yeah, this is going to happen again, the same location that we did back in Season 6. If you remember at this point for last season, but in the moment of that case, it was like the biggest thing that everybody really does and enjoy the moment that we all have to go for. So 68-36 is your final score once again, and then we will have the Timberwolves facing against the other team that goes from the lowest spot. OKC Thunders could be fighting back to get back into the game without the Houston Rockets and the Utah Jazz. They might be just struggling a little bit, and definitely Portland Trailblazers. Yeah, it looks like their next team could be out, and there might not be enough to get over things that are impossible to find an way to get there. In that moment, that ends here. Thanks for watching, and peace out everyone for a while as the NBA 2K Sports of the NBA Play-In Tournament Dial. This is Son of Beast, and you can follow me on my social medias on, on Instagram and TikTok. Discord will be coming soon, so keep your eyes on the new media. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you don't, somebody will. And in the meantime, time to go home and go to bed. Good night, everyone, and see you again next time. Bye-bye. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.